Welcome to this recording about the REST management interface. So first of all, let's try and um, make sure if the REST management interface is enabled. We therefore click on the domain name and we go down to advanced. We check here, enable RESTful management services. Note if it's not enabled, you have to enable it and you have to restart the server. So this is uh, fine here. Then I installed a Chrome REST client. It's actually a Chrome extension that allows me to send simple REST requests like this one. And um, this one is using the new um, API syntax. So it says management WLS latest data sources. And if I send a GET request, look what happens. I'll get the data back for all the data sources that exist. And the cool thing here is again, these are links that I can click on. So if I click on my test data source, again, it would send this request and I get information while well, I need to send it. I get information back about the test data source and I could even trigger a suspend or shrink or reset and so on, and this is all the, the metrics from the data source. Now, the exciting part is we don't send an HTTP GET, but we send an option, HTTP option request. This means it would return a JSON structure that we can then use and fill in the proper name and send it again to create a new data source using HTTP POST. So I click on post. Because it's easier, I take one from the documentation. And um, the reason for this, it already contains all the mandatory uh, values for the keys that I need to provide. So I copy this and I send this as a payload. And I'll try to make sure you see here, we've got the data source name, so I give it a new name. And also I want to make sure that there is a correct chaindi name. So here we see two chaindi names and I just make this my data source chaindi. And I send it as a post, I need to send it as a JSON send and that's it new data source for successfully created if we go back to weblogic you will see it here services data sources data source for created it's still missing a target i probably didn't set a target thanks for watching let's stay in touch